Some of the stocks with the most exciting potential are companies working on solid state batteries for electric vehicles. These stocks can be 10 beggars. Uh, they can literally take us to the electric future that we all want and need. Let's take a look at these potential rockets. This is not financial advice. This is entertainment only. The two hot stocks I'm adding to my hot stock list are Microvast and QuantumScape. These are different companies and have complex futures of which we will be discussing. You can find the list of hot stocks to buy in a pullback at the end of this video. Uh, all the stocks on this list have been discussed in previous videos. QuantumScape is backed by Volkswagen, who has devoted and invested $200 million into their solid state battery development, which is not going to be developed for years as it takes, it's a very difficult process. And they, they talk about uh, developing four layers, and now recently they've uh, developed 10 layers to the battery, and they were surprised that they had made uh, progress so rapidly. Um, it's, things uh, move slow in the solid state battery world. Uh, Toyota talks about maybe having a solid state battery uh, that's workable by 2025. Uh, they have they have some solid state batteries now, but there's problems with them, and they're hoping. We're all hoping that they get solid state batteries that have increased range and power. QuantumScape IPO'd in November of 2020 and has a 10 billion dollar market cap. Why is there so much excitement about the solid state battery? Well, for one thing, they can lower costs uh, because they get rid of some of the anoid material. But the reason it's solid state is they get rid of the liquid electrolyte material. Uh, it's the liquid that makes it uh, unstable and prone to be damaged and to catch fire, uh, which they want to get rid of for sure. What's interesting is the difficulty and how long it takes to develop a solid state battery is also an advantage for the person who develops it first because it, it takes about four or five years to develop this. Once they get this started and get it developed, somebody else is going to think twice before they, they try to do the same thing. Uh, it's, it's going to be a, a huge profit. Uh, they're going to be wanted by many companies, uh, but the, the expanse, you've got to have big backers like Volkswagen, like George Soros, like Bill Gates uh, to put you through all that time and effort. But it's also going to create a moat that it will make other, others uh, have a difficult time entering this arena. The second stock I'm adding to my hot stock list is Microvast. Uh, their shares have been soaring. On August 9th, uh, Morgan Stanley, around that date, uh, an analyst at Morgan St Stanley wrote an article critical of Microvast. Now, Microvast is different from QuantumScape. Microvast actually makes batteries and is selling batteries and have a, a number of partnerships and, and relationships. Uh, and they are working on solid state batteries. But the Morgan Stanley analysts uh, put the stock down and the Wall Street bets crowd decided they didn't like that. The chart I'm showing you shows that Microvast is one of the most discussed stocks recently on Wall Street bets. So it could be considered uh, somewhat of a meme stock. Uh, and it's unusual for a meme stock to have uh, pretty good fundamentals, which, which Microvest has. 
So we got the so if you missed if you missed the fun with GameStop and AMC, the apes are ready to go to town on Microvast. If we look at the chart on QuantumScape, we can see that it's had a rough ride. They hit 114 in December of 2020, and they've gone down over 80%. Uh, to the low 20s, and I think they're hanging around about 24 right now. So I guess logic would say it must be a buy, right? Uh, when you have as big a backers as it has, uh, it's not going to go broke. They have the time to do this, uh, and they have the faith of some very important investors who are willing to go the distance with them. If we look at the chart of Upstart Microvast, we can see that they have a very good chart. Uh, they have a product. They're producing batteries. They're working on solid state batteries, as are Toyota and as are Tesla, which I will compare these two shortly. But uh, it's a smaller uh, company in the sense that they're, they're working on uh, uh, four billion. Uh, so uh, they have a going business. They're doing the research. Uh, they will probably get there. Uh, who gets there first? Uh, my, for my money, I probably go with the one that's producing a product because uh, going from a research to actually producing products uh, is something else as Elon Musk has assured us. And like I say, don't ever underestimate a diamond-handed ape on Wall Street bets. Uh, if they want to push this dog, and it looks like they would like to, uh, they should be able to take this higher than uh, GameStop, uh, higher than AMC. Uh, they, they actually have a company with a product with a bright future. I created a chart that shows how volatile these stocks are. Uh, QuantumScape has lost about 15% in the last three months, uh, but they don't have a product and they're literally burning cash and they have enough to last for years until they get to their goal. Uh, while uh, Microvast, uh, they've made about 18%. Uh, and I also included uh, Tesla in this because Tesla is making batteries uh, and for comparison purposes in the last three months. Tesla has made about uh, 13%. Uh, so it's, it's, a, it's a long game uh, with these batteries, and uh, who knows who's going to come out on top. But I'm sure we're going to have something better in the future for our electric cars. And Tesla, uh, between their uh, trying to get full self-driving and now with their continuing quest with batteries, uh, Tesla just finds multiple and new ways to revolutionize the world, uh, which they probably will do. Well, I never thought I'd be adding uh, two stocks, one of which will be uh, very much pushed forward by diamond-handed apes. Go apes! Microvest is a stonk. Wall Street can bet Here's the list of hot stocks to buy on a pullback that I promised you near the beginning of this video.